guys, welcome back to Sinise's. Ooh, no, what's that? Oh, that's from my bullet journal. Um, welcome back. So today is January the eighth. Yeah, so we just came back from our grandparents' place, and we just stayed there for a week. Well, a little less than under a week. Then on the way back, we went to Katoomba, as you um, as you would have seen in the previous clips. But yes, yeah, so I'm back now. Yeah, thought I'd just bring you guys along, just sort of getting back on track. Cause I'm starting to feel motivated sort of feeling the new year, new me sort of thing. And yeah, so I hope you enjoy this video. Remember to subscribe, thumbs up this video. And yeah, I really wanted to show you guys because in the mail, when, once we got home, my mum actually got a few packages and a few of them I bought for myself. So I'm so excited. I got a new bullet journal. Last year was the first year I sort of invested in a good bullet journal because the other ones I've been using, I've been from like Kmart and um, Office Works, even though that, that was a good one actually, but it was sort of a bit on the cheaper side, but I'm so excited. So yeah, I invested in this last year and it was so worth it because I really love this so much. I just got it again from the same company, Milligram, and got this nice black bullet journal. So I'm very excited to use this. So hopefully for February, I can start using this. This is my January spread. So I'm very excited to, as you probably can tell, it's an Among Us theme. So Amanda Rachel Lee did this for November 2020, but I really wanted to do it, so I just did it for January. And then this part I really like. It's like a little tab that says 2020 was an imposter, just to sort of make fun of 2020 a little bit and try and be a bit more positive and hoping that 2021 will be a bit better than 2020 and then this is the calendar spread and then gratitude slash writing something good that happened that day um and then here's like a sort of master to-do list slash shopping list goals and that sort of stuff and then finish your tasks this did take a while to do but I'm very happy with it, it looks so cool so I got reading exercise golf driving flute foam roll and stretch and then here's a mood tracker and then my to-do list so I sort of try and do that or something like that throughout the month but yeah so that's my January spreads hey guys so today is currently Sunday and I think I might start filming this vlog on Friday because I'm actually feeling very like motivated to do some organizing so I think what I'm gonna do is tackle my shoes and then I even might go through my t-shirts I think gosh look how much better this looks Wow, this is the first time I probably have ever seen my shoe rack so empty. And guys, these are my shirts. Gosh, it used to be so full and packed, but now I only have this one row. But to be honest, actually, I probably do have maybe three or four shirts that are currently in the wash from being away. But gosh, so, so much better. And with Jim, actually, probably doesn't really look much different but i did throw away a few gym shirts yeah so that's all that i'm throwing away so this is the massive pile of clothes yeah so i hope you enjoyed it and i'll talk to you guys in the morning hey guys so sorry if the camera quality is a bit different because i have put it down low because i'm really hot and red as you can see but literally all day probably since maybe 9 30 10 o'clock I've been organizing my room all day and I'm so hot and very like ready to finish but I am going well it's good basically um my closet is all organized even though some parts look a bit messy but it's much better than it was before I'll just sort of flip you guys around and show you what I've been doing that sort of looks the same but I did sort of vacuum across the grooves I've that's why this looks a bit different because I also vacuumed and wiped it in there I sort of did a little bit of organization up there. Then I finally put my window clothes back up here. So I do have a bit more space, but just so I've got garbage bags there. Then with here, so sorry, I won't really be able to show you this side, but I will try to if I can. But as you saw yesterday, much better. And guys, look at the floor. Oh, so I only have my gym bag there. Gosh, so much better. Then up here is a bit crowded, but it's good. I moved all the stuff that which was down here up to 
up there <laughs> and then in here I sort of did a little bit of reorganizing so put more toys there picture frames and sort of reorganize that a little bit and yeah so I'm just going to reorganize my bookshelf a bit so with these garbage bags I have a mixture of vinning stuff slash just for a way so I probably should have done that a bit better but anyway so I've got another bag here and then currently on my bed I've gone through all my stuff so my things from year 11 so from my year 11 exams I never put away my year 11 books and also the stuff that I will be needing for year 12 so so far this is all the stuff I've been needing for year 12 so I sort of been organizing through this with this folder I really want to make this like a daily folder but do it for revision but I'm not really sure how I should do it so guys comment down below and help me out and comment down below what you think I should do so I was sort of thinking each week if I'm making a revision sources maybe putting in here so then I can maybe take it to my free or just keep it at home so yeah let me know what you think and then that's cute all my little toys that I used to have when I was a baby and then this was the toy that I actually had when I was born so very cute and then actually too Josie was very nice enough to organize my bedside table and gosh looks so so much better with this i just got a mixture of papers from last year year 11 slash year 12 of things that i might want to keep or throw away so yeah guys that's sort of what i've been doing today and sorry for not filming a lot i think my goal is is just to try and put all this stuff away and have my room back to normal so yeah <laughs> Okay guys, so I'll show you what I got from the shop. So I got this from David Jones, which you saw me trying on. So the things I decided on were these very nice shorts. They're like a linen material and I never had like a linen material, well sort of anything really. So I'm very excited. So from David Jones, this was from French Connection. And it's good, all this stuff I got on sale. Because I'm surprised the Boxing Day sales have lasted a while. And today is 13th, I think. So, yeah, gosh. And then you actually saw me these trying on. But, gosh, I'm so happy. I got my first ever country road pant. It's so comfy putting on. And, yeah, I just can't wait to wear it. And it was so good. So, originally, it was basically $55 and then I got it for 30 gosh how good's that so got those and then with these ones I'll show you the price so these were originally $80 and I got them for $50 so that's pretty good final thing I got is this very nice shirt which you saw me wear in my try on little clips so this was well I actually just got this on um yeah this wasn't on sale I don't think so I got this for $50 but yeah I'm very excited because I was in a good need of shorts and stuff so now I'm home I actually will show you guys what I've been doing so I've actually been organizing my room and it's so good I finally did so Josie was very nice and helped me out do a bit of organizing so I'll actually show you my cubes first so I'll just do a bit of an overview and that's why I hear the ticking because Josie finally, because it's funny with stuff, I always keep them plastic for a while and then I finally open it and it's good. She set up the clock for me. So yeah, I might be able to use that for study things. And yeah, I'm very happy with that. And instead of having my camera stuff, I decided to keep my school things in there. So books like year 11 stuff or year 12 textbooks, I'll keep at home. And this stuff will all be going to school soon. And then here, so where I used to keep my um, camera bag, I decided just to keep it all there. So it's got my tripods there, phone stuff, microphone, camera bag. So I'm very happy with my closet. And then under my desk is much better too. So it looks the same, but looks much more organized. With my desk, that's a bit messy because <laughs> I was writing a to-do list and stuff. But yeah, so I think I'm not really sure what I'm going to do now. To be honest, I might talk to you guys tomorrow and sort of relax a bit. But yeah. Um, I want to finish my bullet journal set up because I started that last night, but then I was really tired, so I didn't finish it. <laughs>
open. <laughs> but yeah, guys, we're currently at a golf club. And yeah. guys so i hope you enjoyed this video make sure to give a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it subscribe down below and comment down below any video requests and we'll be happy to do it for you guys and we love you so much and we'll see you in our next video bye